Hi, I'm Jim from Connecticut, registered independent, but in most of the presidential elections, I voted Republican, not in 2016 and no intention in 2020. Donald Trump is obsessed with numbers, wants to set records, wants to be number one. I also appreciate numbers and would like to share some with you. Donald Trump lost the last general election by 2.9 million votes. He claims there was some voter fraud, but there's no evidence of that. That actually pales in comparison to the $28 million that was wasted on sending out President Trump's coronavirus guidelines for America. We burnt ours when it arrived. It's also a fraction of what's been spent on housing and protection while he has visited various Trump properties for a number of reasons, including over 250 rounds of golf. Unbelievable. Now, under President Trump's courageous leadership, as Mike Pence stated ad nauseum during daily coronavirus campaign rallies, America has lost over 100,000 lives. Trump blames others. I don't understand it. Some additional numbers. 25 women have accused him of sexual misconduct. All lied, according to Donald. Yet, we do have his admission on that Access Hollywood tape. Seven close associates have been convicted of crimes. We've got six business bankruptcies, five communication directors, four chiefs of staff. What happened to I know the best people? Three wives, family values? Mm. Too much chaos from one impeached president who accepts no responsibility and has released zero tax returns. We simply can't take four more years of this chump. Vote for Joe Biden. Let's return decency to the West Wing. Thank you.